What I really would like to do is actually share some words of sorrow, but I'm going to prompt you bring it first with some some uh, poems. We are Sukkah and we are home and mom. Our colors are warm like a Beaujolais bouquet. This room's maroon, but never marooned. And even if I were to be, I want to be marooned with you. This year is going to bring in gold, silver, glitter, no litter, more thriving, less surviving, no strife, just lechaims. Everybody, lechaims. Not done, but we should all take a little sip. <coughs> if you've got one. Amen. A year where jewel tones jam our homes with flushed rust and chestnut, starlit with scarlet, vermilion, and a million other shades of garnet gilded dreams. God give us a pashmina of meaning from floor to ceiling, sukami, burgundy, velvet, and cream. Let's house some shrina between us and make poetry between these walls of sheets. Write me in fuchsia infused pen. Take this. <laughs> Write me in fuchsia infused pen and open the door to let something strange in, something foreign. I'm talking getting reborn in to a whole new matrix of human. Let's annex the next palace of genetic potential here in this leafy green hovel where all things are possible. Yeah. This is called Uspizin. Please be my guest, Uspizin, so pleasing. Let's, let's host each other and usher in the best year yet. A year made like a mansion, and did I mention you are the reason I've settled in this otherwise uninviting region of the Middle East? It's because of you and me and the weenus that weaves between us like baubles in these dreamy leaves. We are each other's surrogate family in a date palm palace of orphans, richly embellished with the bling of being siblings, the pampered kinder of the Queen of Queens. So come in in your crimson and your riots of rubies. Be my guest, well-dressed, well-blessed in this jewelry box of leaves and promise to never leave. Oh, this is an interesting. This is her book. Yeah. Is her I wrote book. these. This so is my amazing. babies. Yeah. This is amazing. Yeah, I have a book of poems on all the Jewish holidays. Da -da -da. It's but lit. they're really, it's called lit. Like, <laughs> you like. Yeah, it's a, yeah, someone at Fairgrounds. It, it came out the Hanukkah before Corona. So it kind of came out, and I was like, okay, that's that, you know? <laughs> So, came out and went back yeah, right, right. But it's actually quite good. And it's like lit. The idea of lit is that like <laughs> literature, uh, lit candles of the hog, right? And and being lit, so right? And, the, and then the, you know, the kind of poetic lit idea of like the slang. Okay. Okay, so so we know that one of the ideas of, of this, I won't take it personally. I won't take it first. So um, we know that this is the understood to be the Chag to see and be seen, right? It's this, the Chag of, of, of seeing each other and being seen by God. This is the Chag to see and be seen. And here we all are swimming in a sea of extended family, beholding these faces, grace to be here in this place, like winners of this marathon called the human race. Thick in these prayer tents, where a million minyanim sin nagunim, all of us members of the same band, belting songs of the Levim. Shuckling and swooning, lulav shaking, challah bacon, bracha making. Let us never forget the music of this unforgettable syllable of God's own soliloquy, known as Sukkot in the streets of Jerusalem. God's very own best poem better known as we, seeing each other and being seen. Wow. Time, time, time.